Welcome, Welcome to the group chat with, with Jess and Manana. I thought we decided we're going to look into the camera instead. Oh, yeah. Well, you didn't do that. I Welcome didn't do it. Welcome to the group chat. <laughs> Welcome back, you guys. Uh, I think both of us are on the struggle. You look really cute, but Thanks. are you feeling alive? I am. Good. I woke up late today. Boy, well, boy. <laughs> like, boy, 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 um i had an alarm for nine i woke up i was fine and then i went back to sleep <laughs> didn't have an alarm for later and i woke up at 11 why because like the weekend i like don't know i didn't sleep after a night out i never sleep a lot mm -hmm. i wake up really early yesterday i woke up at nine had a little bit of anxiety because i was like literally texting everyone i'm like wait who's up like i need to make sure i didn't do anything like embarrassing like i need people to tell me Everyone was also drunk yeah. and nobody was thinking about it. Okay, good. Literally it's normally I, I know if like something's coming the next day in terms of like what I'm going to hear. I didn't feel that way. Like, I don't think I did anything. Also, you were like with us. Like there's there was literally right. nothing. Even if you did the most wild shit, like nobody right. important. You know what mention I did yesterday? My chili that looked insane. It was oh my absolutely God. insane. You should make it today. No. It, it took t not even 10 minutes. I want to marinate in my death today. <laughs> Do you want to say why? I'm just feeling a little depressed. Yeah. Just girly things, but why? One, because I think I'm actually going to cry right now because I'm so fucking tired. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to cry. I'm crying. That's okay. I'm, this is so it's stupid. It's okay to cry. This is literally stupid. No, I'm just frustrated. I yeah. think I have like a lot going on and like I'm not managing my time well i think or maybe i am and i'm just not getting to everything and then i just got invited to like literally one of the coolest things in my life and i can't go because it's during his mom it's during it can't even fucking speak because i'm so sad it's during mom's birthday weekend in miami and um there's not much i can do like obviously i'm not gonna pick that over Bonchik, what are you eating thank you Mm -hmm. I'm not going to pick that over mom's birthday weekend when it's already planned. Like if it was just like a birthday here. Like, oh, that would be different. Yeah. You I'd be go. like, listen, mom, I got to go. But, but it's not. And this is something like dad is planning and like, you know, mm -hmm. all of us are going like, I just can't miss it. And I think I'm like coming to understand sometimes, you know, you just, you're only missing out this time though. You're going to be invited many, many, many more times. I understand, but it but is. But it's still sad. It's still sad, and I just found the news literally like thirty minutes ago. So yeah, I'm, I'm feeling the emotions on top of like literally being so tired. I didn't catch up on my sleep this weekend because we went out, and I wasn't even planning on drinking because. But nobody was like drinking, so I was like, I have to drink with you. It's for your birthday, or mm -hmm. else you were gonna like, you know, mm -hmm. not drink and not have a good time. So then I woke up yesterday with just a ton of anxiety of all the things I needed to do and I couldn't chill because I had stuff like that I told every like people that I would like meet them and hang out with them and it wasn't stuff that I can cancel on. So I'm just feeling. I think you have a, a lot to do. I'm just feeling. No. I'm feeling it. And I want to just cry remember, and go to bed. Chris Jenner has the same amount of hours in our day. I remind myself that every day. Chris Jenner has the same. She's probably up for 15 hours a day. Well, I know her schedule. Oh, what is it? She wakes up at 4.30 or 5 to work out. And then she's like, by the time I hit 7, like, I'm getting, she's like, I get frustrated when people aren't messaging me back. She's like, that's lunchtime. <laughs> I'm crying. What time do you think she sleeps? Uh, she sleeps early, she said. She sleeps like 8 or something eight, like that. Yeah. So. I would, ugh, I would love to get back to like waking up early. I don't know what to do. I feel like I need to sit down and like get my life together, but I don't know how to do that. You write notes. You write your main tasks, and then you just start crossing off the tasks. Like I'll write it at night, and then I wake up and I like am not getting them done. Okay, because you're just you're just writing them out. You writing yeah. them out wasn't going to do anything, so you have to hold yourself accountable. When people don't have like response, like when there's no how do I say it? Like when I was first starting out content, like I treated it like it was a job. Mm -hmm. Like I'd be like, okay, today, like my job is this, like I have to post this. I have to go to Beth's house and she has to take a photo of me. Like I treated it like a nine to five. Yeah. So I think that's what you have to do. If you're just doing this nonchalant, like, like giddy yaddy, like 
I think that people who are like successful in the social media world, like they treat it like a job, even though mm-hmm. it seems like it's not. And I think that's the beauty of it. So treat it like a job. I think I started struggling with my other aspects of life when I started really taking like social media more seriously. Like, like it's actually all I do. What do you mean you struggle with other aspects? Like my room is always dirty now because <laughs> I'll like quickly get ready and then I'll like film of like what I'm wearing that day and then leave. I don't have time to clean up my room. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? Like yeah. little things like that. I literally do not do my homework until right before it's due. Poor time management on my part. If I could just wake up at seven, do all of like my morning, because I literally record like all of my morning and then I spend two hours editing it. I need to stop editing so much too. Yeah, don't do that. I just feel like people will get bored if I don't edit like the short silences or something like that. Well, don't have silences. Yeah, I need to like, get better at like speaking. Yeah, just don't have silences. There's no need to edit all that stuff because it's time consuming and frankly like it's not needed yeah and if your place is a mess you should see my place when it's clean yep because i'm i clean dude juan was over on friday and i was filming so much Mm -hmm. it was beautiful when he came in during the end i go i go juan like it was before your birthday Mm -hmm. i was like juan you go i'm gonna meet you at your house like then we'll go to jess's birthday like i was like i need like 40 minutes to clean yeah Every day I'm deep cleaning my place because yeah. that's just just part of the job. Mm-hmm. You see people like uh, there's this girl. Her name is Monet. I love Monet. She's a TikToker. Yeah. Do you know her? She's very cute. Monet like Michaels, her. I think. Michaels or Michaels? Uh, I'm not sure. I know Michaels. she's dating somebody that was on The Bachelor. At uh, no, he was on um, like, like Love Island. Was it Love Island or uh, not Love is Blind? Not Love is Blind. The other one. There was, there's another one. I can't remember. I think he was on Love Island. J- Jared or J Jared or some with the J. I'm not sure. Um, she has the craziest house. It's literally always messy, and then she like deep cleans, and then and it gets crazy again. Like it's something you just can't avoid. Mm-hmm. So just set think times apart. Like I feel like you're just scrolling on your phone sometimes. Yes, I spend way too much time on my phone. I know, I know. It's hard. Like, oh, sorry. What happened? <laughs> something in my lip. Help. Oh. Uh, is there any in my teeth? I cannot see from okay. here. I hope you guys can't see. <laughs> Wait, I'm going to die. If, if I can't see it from here, you, okay. I don't think they can. Um, I lit- I spend way too much time on my phone. Yeah. Like, n- unneeded time. Yeah. I understand that. So, I think step one for you and anybody who's listening in, I just can't figure it out their life. I think you really need to make a mandatory list. Not just, like, yeah. a, like a fun list. Like, mm-hmm. realistic things. Right. You know? Like, n- not of things you need to do for your whole le- life. Just tomorrow, what do right. I need to do? I'm going to do that tonight. What's my week goal? What's my daily goal? And My school get my school gets in the way of everything. <laughs> well, you need it. Yeah, I know. You need to finish. <laughs> I know. I do. So let that be a priority as well, Jess. Yeah. You know? But, like, now I'm just like, wait, like, I have school tomorrow? Like, <laughs> I know. what do you mean? I know, but you can, it's all possible. Right. If Chris Jenner could manage all the Kardashians and Jenners, it's you definitely can do possible. All these I'm in Calm 101. <laughs> yeah. Ew, I hated Calm 101. I remember I that I have class. a speech tomorrow and you're going to be in it. What is it? it's about like my future career. Bye. I'm in it? <laughs> yeah. What are you saying about me? Because she said you have to talk about like experts in your in your um, i'm an expert field yeah Ooh. the expertist wow expertise the expertise is that what it is expertise yeah. i knew expertise wasn't a word but I, you're thinking exorcism and that's not what's going down no today. i knew what i said wasn't a word oh, okay yeah so i'm an expertise you're an expert i appreciate that in my powerpoint well you want to say the speech now i actually haven't written it yet <laughs> it's due tonight oh my god see <laughs> see if I had, I literally, you guys had two weeks off. What were you doing? <laughs> God knows. Like, God knows. Literally. I need to f- we need to figure this out. I don't know what's going on. It's okay. Literally, yeah. like there's, th- it's not like there's a rush, but I understand like. No, like it overwhelms like, me. Yeah, I know. Something that Juan always tells me and I'm like, I'm like, Juan, I'm stressed. He's like, you're stressed because you you're unorganized right now. Yeah. So like, what can we do? Yeah. Remember when I was that fighting king? with mom about the bakery and she's like, you're so unorganized. Like, and I was like, you're such a liar. Like, I'm not unorganized. Maybe I am a little <laughs> unorganized. You're 
you're getting there. Yeah. Like, I'm just not used to like doing things. <laughs> <laughs> you're a working woman. Yeah. Welcome to the world. Literally. Get used to it now. So by the time you're a pro at this and you're like thriving and you're an expert, well, you are an expert in your career, you know, then no, you'll have like not. a great way to manage it. Yeah. Because there's a lot of moving parts in life. Like when you have kids, I mean, you have a boyfriend, when you have a mm-hmm. dog, da, 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 all these things. What I was saying, and then we said chili. Mench and I yesterday were <sighs> looking through I your guys' um, old videos, or her old videos, when she, from when she was like 21 to like 24. Mm-hmm. Watched all her videos. Why? Because someone was like, what was your favorite birthday? And no, after that, she um, looked. It was because Eka was there, mm-hmm. and Eka and Mench went to Greece together. Mm hmm. And they were talking about this one night. And I was like, oh, my God, show me the video. And then she airplayed her phone. And she meant has the funniest videos. Yeah, she she records everything. Oh, everything. And um, it was the funniest videos. We saw the video of you telling the lake story. Oh, yeah. The lake story. That's well, that ha- story has been told. Maybe 10,000 times. Like minimum. I, I couldn't even I can't even tell you. Well, long story short, me and a friend, it was my first time hanging out with this friend group. We got stuck in the middle of the lake <laughs> and I'm like deathly scared of sharks. I know there's no And lakes, her and her shark. friend are both extremely dramatic. Yeah. So they, 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 I know there's no sharks in the lake. OK, let's get that clear. But I just have this image like even taking baths. I feel like there's a shark in this bath. Wait, I feel that way, too. And in, in the, the pool. pool. Goodbye. Oh, no. Jesus Christ. I it just had a heart me. attack thinking about it. I'm not even kidding. Sorry, mm-hmm. Bunchy. Freaked the hell out. Freaked her out. Bunchy, if you had a fear like that, you would understand. I wonder if her fear is coyotes. Like, she doesn't even know. No. She doesn't even know what could, like, what murder could her. What could her? <gasps> no, my heart is literally singing. I'm going to cry again. But don't, don't bring up anything emotional to me right now. <laughs> I swear to God. Like, my sweatshirt is the perfect thing. I'm feeling blue. Blue. <laughs> And I'm wearing blue. Like I'm the most feeling <laughs> blue. <laughs> I'm feeling blue today. Yeah. Literally, all my emotions are out. That's okay. Like death. Oh my you didn't God. cry the other Sunday, so you got to cry today. Yeah, I'm really making up for it. Mm-hmm. Um, what was I gonna say? I was talking about something. The lake. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And then so the two friends were in the water, and I was like on this like little raft because I'm like I'm not going in the water, so they were just like pushing me. <laughs> And that's like the whole point of the lake story. Yeah. Oh, I wish. I'm so sorry. I feel like I'm not giving him my. I'm giving him my hundred percent, but I feel like the um, and ener- the exaggerations are not there. More passion. More, more passion. passion. More passion. More energy. It more happens. energy. But I am trying, and I'm happy to be here. These things, like the podcast, truly like lifts up my mood. Mm-hmm. So everything will Me be too. okay. You. I was you last Monday when we were supposed to film. I was crying before the episode. Oh yeah, and then we weren't. We weren't filming. Yeah. Um, what else did, what else did you see in the videos? Oh, you brought um, it up like you saw something crazy of me. No. Oh, I was just saying like, that's what, that's what we were doing yesterday. Yeah, that's fun. I love that. It was so fun. She has so many videos. Mm-hmm. It's crazy. It was like her clubbing videos and it's because it's fun for me to watch things like that because I feel like I just met you guys <laughs> <laughs> like four years ago. <laughs> Literally. And I only know what's happened since then. Like, yeah. I really don't know everything like or anything you guys have done. I don't know much about Munch either. Like, I think I started hanging out with her when I don't remember, like when when she was 23 and no. I was 20. Yeah, that really? sounds right. Mm-hmm. That sounds about right. Like your guys 19 l- or I was either 19 or 20 and I'm 24. S- wait, what? You're 26. 26. <laughs> <laughs> wait, why did I think yeah. I was 24? I don't know. That's so depressing i'm gonna cry again (laughs) (laughs) wait that's like an amazing age i know an amazing age to miss out on fucking opportunities okay we'll get over this one day yeah maybe next year when they invite me again yeah if they fucking invite me they will (sighs) okay carrying on um so this weekend was a lot of fun it was a lot of fun It was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. It was. It actually yeah. was. Um, I think you had the most fun, which I'm so happy about. I did have the there most fun. There was a super southern man at the club. <laughs> oh, God. I knew you were going to bring this up. Why? Uh, what was Yar. his name? Uh, should I say? Yeah. Andrew. It was his name was Andrew? Yeah. Sounds southern as hell. Yeah. 
he was, he was really nice. nice yeah he was really nice and his friends were really nice they were all southern yeah they were at the table that we were at last time and I'm i like, know i'm like did you guys get this comp or you guys paid for it tell yeah, me right now that's what i want to know too you should have asked they did what does he do for work paid for it um, finance to be honest i'm not sure you got what did you guys talk about you guys were talking the whole damn night i actually don't remember <laughs> <laughs> he was really sweet he was sweet how the hell did he come to our table we were in the worst table on earth i literally don't know i did, oh you guys you know who we met oh wait the little asian man from hangover <laughs> that was not him no basically it was no i actually hated him i didn't like him either yeah he was um actually really annoying no he was he so looked just like him wait <laughs> that is crazy for you to say his name was mr chow yes Mr. Chow, and no. what's the name in The Hangover? What's no his name? Idea. It's literally something like that. I have no idea. He pissed me off. No, like, I almost, like... Really? I almost got him kicked out. Why? What did okay. he do? Starting off, he came in and he was, like, talking to I don't know who trying to get us a bottle. Mm -hmm. And I'm like... No, trying to give somebody money. Me. He was I, trying to give me money because someone it, said it was my birthday. Listen, one thing I know, money comes with money comes with strings. No, okay. I Le no, no like, like, like we I'm don't not need taking that. Your money. No, listen, yeah. we don't need that. Thank yeah. you. You know what men said to him? What? He like kept um taking money out and she goes, To be honest with you, we have money. <laughs> 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 no because he was trying to fl i'm yeah. dead that she said that because he's trying to flash it like hey he had like stacks out like like trying to impress doing? us like we don't listen you're at the wrong table no like even get 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 it get nah. get, get 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 no because he was trying to piss me the fuck yeah. off and let me tell you why he came over i actually forgot about mr chow until you brought him up and now i'm now i'm pissed he came over trying to give somebody money and i'm like I'm like, listen, we're OK. Thank you so much. Like, I know there's so many birthday girls over here. Like, feel free to give them money. He's like, he's like that table over there. I gave her four hundred dollars. I'm like, OK, go give her another one. Like, we don't thank you so much, but we're OK. He got us a champagne bottle. OK, got oh, us. He got a champagne. Listen, he got us a champagne bottle because he's like, no, 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 no. Like, I, I, I come here every weekend, every month and I live in Denver and I'm like, what do you do for work? He goes, I'm a dentist. I'm like, oh, my sister's a dentist. And he mm -hmm. thought the whole time, like it was Mench's birthday. Yeah. He's like, oh, the girl, the birthday girl. I'm like, yes. And so I was like, Mench, he's a dentist too. Cause he's like, I'm a dentist. I mean, she's like, oh, okay, cool. So he gets us a champagne bottle, right? Okay, mm -hmm. cool. Whatever. Then he takes out his phone and he's, he's like, he's like, hold the bottle and like, he's like hold the bottle because he's trying to take videos of it i literally grabbed the bottle from mench's hand because mench was like okay i grabbed the bottle from mench's hand she's like i don't give a fuck you know like mm -hmm. take this fucking video and leave yeah i grabbed the bottle and i said you are not taking videos of any of us get get out uh-huh and he's like okay he stuck around i'm like whatever like i don't give a damn just don't take videos of us if you're here you're here i'm not gonna you're literally two feet yeah. tall literally. no one's intimidated by you yeah Anyways, he got the vibe because I was like low key getting aggressive because mm -hmm. I'm like, yo, j originally get out. And now that he's not getting out, you got us a bottle. OK, if, you, if you're paying us for the bottle, that's what I'm saying. Money has always yeah. strings attached to it. OK, right. We're not the one. We don't care no. about your damn bottle. Your damn bottle, your damn cash. No, like y you, you got the wrong group. Yeah. So then he orders a tequila bottle for you. Mm -hmm. That's when that they come out with the service bottle. Da -da 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 -da. OK. He starts you know taking funny? Jess. He starts taking a video from you, leg up, and I literally smack the phone out of his hand. The phone falls on the ground. I said, I said no videos. Wait, I had no idea that this happened. Yes, I said no videos, and then he's like, okay. And then he then he sat and sat with our other friend on the booth, and I went over to her and I said, are you good? Like to her, and she was like, yeah, like I, I don't care. Like I'm mm -hmm. she she works like she works in the in the hospitality industry like she's like used to like people being annoying like yeah. she can literally block them out mm -hmm. like this guy was a trip wait i didn't know he did all that yes just i smacked his phone out of his hand fell on the ground good bro get out no I, I get crazy with that shit yeah like what are you, you want to get a bottle you want to get us a bottle okay get us a bottle don't fucking come with these strings attached shit because yeah. we said we don't want that yeah no good one for you. ladies good thing you were there no ladies know that like when you go to the club, men are weird. Mm -hmm. Always have your eyes look out for all, keep the, keep an eye out for Selena all the time. 
people like me it need someone me. like you with them <laughs> because i don't see anything i'm the one it's so funny <laughs> because see. i feel like i'm that i'm that like friend slash sister in the group uh-huh. like even malin like our cousin her name is melinda we call her malin just for future reference and when we would go out like Bella like never like really likes her going out. She's like, if you're with Mon, I'm like, I don't care. I'm yeah. like, no, because I got like we're good. Yeah. If I'm there, we're good. Mm-hmm. I won't get wild and crazy if you don't make me get wild and crazy. Mm-hmm. No, because I can get there if you piss me. I've n- I think I theorize <laughs> theoretically, <laughs> God theoretically, willingly. God willingly. If you piss me off, I could. But when I'm like when. I'm drinking. I'm like in the clouds. Like no, you can't be. Like I don't. <laughs> Literally, just you cannot be. I need I you to like always, 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 always. Well, be I alert. don't drink with anybody that's not like. No, but then you have weirdness like that. Huh? You need to be responsible yourself. Right. That's true. I do, do need. You to. know, like no one's gonna look out for you the way you look out for yourself. True. And are your friends the most responsible people? I would say no. Yeah, I don't. Yeah. You know. So Definitely. always. Well, always I don't keep drink. An eye out too much when i'm with them i understand yeah but it's so easy to slip things it's yeah. so easy for men to be weird mm-hmm. and to take you mench said i was like where's where's jess mench goes she says she'll be back in a minute she says she needs a few minutes i'm like oh my god this bitch went to the bathroom i ran to the bathroom i'm like yo what are you doing mm-hmm. me yes oh i was editing <laughs> No, not at not at Tao dinner, Tao oh. club. Oh, and, and then like, is that when you guys showed up at the table? Well, that was first. Second one, w- first one was you went to the bathroom alone. Never go to the bathroom alone. Are you on? Un- are you unwell? I don't remember going to the bathroom. Yes, you went to the bathroom. I had the security come take me to the bathroom. I'm like, she's in here. He said, I'll show you where. I was like, I'm looking for my sister. She says she's in the bathroom. He's like, okay, follow me. Took me to the bathroom. Then you came. Oh. And we went down. And I was like, the line is too long. Yes. I remember. Okay. Don't ever go to the bathroom alone. Okay. Second time was when we were leaving. You were going to say bye to somebody. Had no idea. And I'm like, where is Jess? She said, she'll be back in a minute. I'm like, oh, I know where this guy's table is. So I went and I'm like literally peeking. I'm asking his friends. I'm like, uh-uh. Come on. <laughs> I'm not the one. No. I was I was out there working <laughs> overtime. overtime. Thank you so much for doing that. Fish. I don't drink like that anymore. Like... I drink minimally now. I learned at your birthday. That was so your happy. birthday was my lesson. I was like, wait, I'm literally having a fabulous time just being When which birthday? This year. Wait, what did I do for my birthday? Dre's. Oh. Like I was like yeah. good. Yeah. You know? I wasn't like too much. But this was my birthday. And like I got it. I had to, no, you know. Like you're absolutely fine too, but always just still be responsible. Right. What did I do? Or if you're not being responsible, let somebody know. Be like, okay, tonight I'm going to drink. Like, make sure like you're good. So you're all on the same page. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. right. Friday. What did I do? Um, You went out with you went to breakfast with Grant. It was your real birthday. That was my real birthday. Jardine at Wynn is like our birthday spot for lunch. I don't know why because it's not even delicious. No, it's not that good. But it's just like we have to go. Yeah. It, it, it's it's like a fun vibe and mm-hmm. i feel like honestly when we go there and like we eat and it's good mm-hmm. but it's not like something i ever crave never isn't that so funny but i think we enjoy like going to the strip and then we like go to a few stores yeah, and yeah look I, at stuff yeah because when is just the best it is the best hotel um i went with my friend grant and then sad he I wasn't d- there this weekend i would have loved to meet him i know he had work he really wanted to be there i wanted him to be there glad his priorities are straight yeah but i don't know it, there was like something about my birthday this year that i don't know why everyone kept calling me princess but and i literally felt like a princess oh my god i love that yeah you are princess jess princess jess i just wait i just saw this tiktok of this guy being like a burp is grosser than a fart and i'm like i think all of it is disgusting no definitely a fart is grosser than a. he's burp. like because a fart it comes out of your butt he's like that's where you poop He's like, and he's like, but a burp, if you burp and that is coming out of your mouth and I get a whiff of it. I just feel like I know exactly who made that video. (laughs) Who? He has like short buzzed hair. No. Oh. It was like this guy I've never seen. Oh. He was really funny because in the beginning he was like, I have to talk about something really controversial and I know like a lot of you guys are not going to agree, but I have to say this because it's really been, I've been thinking about it. Mm -hmm. 
I think a burp is grosser than a fart. I love when like people are like that, yeah, you know, like too. take everything so lightly. Mm-hmm. Like, come on. Uh, Wait, I have a shit. question. What? Um, do you take like birthday messages personally? Like if someone doesn't message you, I know we disagree on this, oh, yeah, but yeah. I'll tell you why. Okay. Like if someone doesn't say happy birthday to you, it like does not change the way you feel about them. Does it make me feel, well, I think it really depends. I think there's like a solid 10, what? We're good. Yeah. Okay. Am I recording? Yeah. Yeah. I think there's a solid 10 people in this world that have to wish me happy birthday. If they don't, then we're beefing. Mm-hmm. Um, internally, I'm never going to express it, Right. but if they don't wish me happy birthday, like, like an acquaintance or ki- even like a friend, mm-hmm. I'd be like, okay, that was like weird, but even better. Cause I'm not going to wish you happy birthday. Like uh, yeah. he, I, I don't care for birthday messages other than from my family and like Juan and mm-hmm. li- like, I'm not kidding you. 10 people. It's just, it, mm. it's an inconvenience for me to reply to everybody. Like I, Half of the half of your birthday is you spending time answering calls, answering messages. Like, can we just like enjoy this day without anybody bothering you? Isn't that the whole purpose of it? <laughs> then you have to sit here no. and like reply to just a, one sentence. Happy birthday. Thank you. Like, yeah, no, just, I appreciate it. But like, it's I definitely don't need it. Although it's inconvenient to reply. Sometimes. I love replying. It's literally my favorite. I love that for you. <clears throat> but not like the random ones like not not random like not the one-liners i don't like responding to those i copy and paste those yeah but the like heartful heartfelt ones those don't even hit me because i know you're just saying shit because it's my birthday like i'm like oh thank you so much that's so sweet of you to say really no i think people mean it no i think they mean it but it's just like i'm not i'm not expecting anything less yeah you know what i mean yeah like what am i what am i what are you supposed to message me you suck no, they're going to be like, you are the best, like so grateful to have you in my life. You're one of the most light, amazing people. You, you light up every room you walk in. Like everyone says the same mm-hmm. shit, including myself. And yeah. I mean it, <laughs> but like, yeah, ugh. I'll tell you why I take it personal. Okay. And I make a mental note because like that actually just means like you could care less about me if you don't say happy birthday, you know, like you saw my 10 million stories my three posts like you saw all that and you still couldn't take like 15 seconds out of your time did to somebody say happy like birthday did somebody important not message you a few people not insanely important but people that should have mm. and it's like i, I need see to know you. who after yeah i see you often oh you actually used to have a crush on me oh <laughs> oh she went there oh she went there oh she said and it. you still didn't say happy birthday to me oh who is it like a few people. Armenian? Yeah. Oh, I have a I could, feeling. I don't, I don't think about anyone else that's not Armenian in oh, terms okay. of like, like my best friends that aren't Armenian, they all said happy birthday to me at midnight. Like, okay. Like they're not in the question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But our brother-in-law, he doesn't have Instagram. He didn't say happy birthday to me. Leo didn't yeah. wish you happy birthday? No, and I'm going to. I'm going to grill him about it, but I expected it because he's just like, I don't care. You shouldn't expect that shit. Like I used to be like, oh yeah, he didn't wish me happy birthday either. It's so, it's so typical Leo. No. Wish me happy birthday. Yeah. I'm going to tell him about it next Because we're family. I told, like I told dad, listen, if you have an important birthday of somebody, write it in your calendar (laughs) and put every year, every year reminder. (laughs) <laughs> the number one person in my family <laughs> for i don't i'm not holding it like i don't hold it against him it's okay my dad <laughs> it's fucking crazy this has happened like three times it's literally not no, it's not okay <laughs> he forgets my birthday that's literally not okay i'm so sorry <laughs> that would bother me i'd be like li- i would go in his phone and i would put it in my calendar your favorite daughter's birthday yeah <laughs> he knows what day is my birthday but when the day comes he doesn't realize oh this is march 15th He'll remember a closing date. Yeah, he'll remember a closing he'll date. He'll remember to show a client a house. <laughs> no, I'm giving him a hard funny. time. But yeah. Bruh, if I were to forget my child's birthday, I would cut my toes off. <laughs> For real. Cut my toes off. I he did. He did. He did bring some beautiful flowers. He did. And he did own up to it. He, and he did. was like, I can't believe it. I saw this girl. He said, I spoke to this girl three times today. Yeah. <laughs> and like every time I like paused for a second like are you about to like are you about to say happy birthday or yeah no no. and no it wasn't it's okay it's okay no i he's very busy and he's very overwhelmed and stressed it happens 
It does happen. He um, is he is very much forgiven. Thank you for for having us in this life, Dad. Yes, thank you. <laughs> so yeah, that was Friday. I, and then we just had family dinner. Everyone was so tired that night. We were, were really? all, like dead. Yeah, I didn't think that. Oh, I yeah. was really tired. Really. Um, yeah. and then Saturday we had the recreation sweat event. Mm-hmm. It was really fun. Thanks for taking me. You're welcome. You Thanks. were invited. Kind of. <laughs> no, you were. She said, tell your sister. Oh. Yeah. Okay. That wasn't me. That's all you right there. I it didn't get fun. a plus one. It was tell your sister ah, too. Okay. Which was exciting. Yeah. Do you like those types of events? Like, do you like look That's forward to them? That's literally like what I like am most excited for. Yeah. That, I don't know. There's like two things that I really have fun doing. And it's like, well, I'm, I think that might've been my first event that I was invited. That's a fun first event yeah. to go to. And PR. PR is so fun to me. I'm like, wait, you want to send me something? This is I fun. I love that. No, that's so yeah. fun. You'll get so many and you'll be like, oh my God, this is so exciting. Then you'll give them to mom. Yeah. And like me. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm excited <laughs> and ju- to and like Mench. have so much of it that I like give it away. <laughs> You'll do uh, giveaways. Yeah. Um, the weekend was fun. I'm just, I'm excited for next, this weekend. I get Yoshik. I know. Oh I can't my God. It. Oh my God. The photo, the photo of her that I posted yesterday. I know. Oh, I wanted to eat her. Oh my God. Her, f- somebody messaged me and goes, she looks like a character, like a Disney character. I'm like, she does. Stop. She looks animated. Like Ponchi. Like, wasn't that cute as a puppy? She, when she gets cuter as she gets she older. Gets older. Are Sweet. they the same kind? Yeah, they're both English okay. Cocker Spaniels. So there's American, which we were originally wanting, but it's so hard to find. Nobody right? has American Cocker Spaniels. I don't know. You'd think in America there'd be some American <laughs> Cocker Spaniels. <laughs> You're funny for that. Yeah, no, there's literally none. Like, you know those, those like videos when like they like braid Cocker Spaniels hairs? That's They American. have longer ears, right? Yeah, that's American. Mm. They're just bigger in general. Like, remember when you guys thought Bonchik was going to grow? I'm like, no, guys. I'm telling you, she's done growing. Mm-hmm. This is her at her full Ugh. capacity. My she's so girl. perfect. I'm so annoyed because literally before we were filming, what? It doesn't look right. <laughs> it doesn't look, look like right. like a bird. I look like a bird? Okay, good. <laughs> I'm like a bird. It was literally like showing three bars like fully, yeah. fully charged. 67%. What's 67? It said before. No, that was the other chart. That was the other battery. Oh. You're getting confused. It's all right. It's about to die. It's at 5%. Anyways, so we'll just do audio for the remainder of the time because I have Pilates at 3 and it's 2.15. Mm-hmm. Anyways, so... um, So what? What were we talking about? I don't even know, honestly. Are yeah. we... Our upcoming... I was talking about my upcoming weekend because I'm so excited Ms. for Miss Yojik. Um, I have to prep all of her stuff because I leave for LA on Wednesday. Wednesday night. I have a brand trip with Nexus. Mm, hair, fun. The hair, hair brand. I'm really excited. It'll be really Wait, fun. Wait, that's fun. I know. It'll be a fun time. Yeah. So um, we'll be doing that. Mm-hmm. Or I'll be doing that. And then I come back Friday afternoon. And then Saturday morning we leave. And then we grab her. And then we Oh, I can't wait out. to see her. I know, dude. I just want to hold her. Yeah. Sweet freaking angel. Like ugh, another another one of my fears of a coyote taking one of these girls. I can't. Why is that like such a big fear of mine? Would you say that's like your like in your top fears? At this point, it's my number one fear. It's your number one fear? At at this point in my life, it's my number one fear, yes. And my second one is getting abducted. Yeah, that's one of mine. Like legit, like getting taken. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry, what? Getting to uh, like Yeah. Don't take me, please. Now, you don't want to because I'm annoying as hell. <laughs> no, bitch. You're not like, I'm gonna be like, no, God, please. No. Yeah. I don't know what the fuck I would do. Yeah. Like, I I know what I would do. I'm not going to give my secrets away. <laughs> no. Because you never know who's watching. And they're definitely Robin. No, and they're definitely Robin. But I, I like, I know what I would do and I would absolutely make it out alive. Mm-hmm. But it is an absolute fear of mine. I think mm-hmm. every girl is like fearing, definitely. fearing this. Uh-huh. Oh, and the light turned off. Oh, Am I dark? No, not dark, but you should turn it on. It's it's, it's dead. dead. It's dead. It's dead. Okay. No, like everything is dead today, including me. Something's not right. It's fine. It happens. <sighs> you know what I think? I think you need to let yourself feel upset sometimes and not make it a whole like, no. why am I feeling upset? Just feel upset. It's fine. 
I do, but I, I do. And then like, but like why I was upset was 30 minutes before we started filming. Like I'm going to carry it out. No, I'm not definitely. like, but you know, like I'm not like bipolar. I'd be like, okay, I'm, I'm fine. Yeah. Yeah. No, definitely. Like, I'm going to be depressed. Something about us is like, day. we can't hide our emotions. No. If I'm annoyed, you're going to know it. Know it. If we're sad, you're going to know I it. I called Juan. I'm like, Juan, call me when you get like, get out of work. He's like on lunch break. He calls me and he's like, he's like, <laughs> like what the fuck he goes don't be he's like don't be upset like basically he's like don't be upset like be so like happy that you got invited to something like this i'm like no like you're saying all the wrong things right like you should be like oh my god no like cry that's terrible that's just the worst thing in the world when i'm upset i don't want to i don't want a devil's advocate no i don't i want to hear that is so terrible like yeah don't i, I want to hear both like first once, once you see I'm calm, I'm like bawling my eyes out to him. And you're like, shut up. Like, I don't want to hear that. And I know he means well. No, of course. I'm not talking about Juan when I say that. I oh, just okay. mean like everything in general. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. if I'm upset, I need to be let. I need to be need let to be, to be upset. I need to be alone. No, I like to rant when I'm upset. I actually agree with that. Yeah. And there's one group chat in this world that hears it. <laughs> and it's the rich girls. I didn't even text in the room. I actually called Mench and I was like, dude, I'm, I'm very upset about this. What did she say? And she was like, oh, man. She's like, I understand. But she's like, but no, like, it's not going to be the last one. Of course and she's not. like, and just know that everyone's going to be there that weekend and you're going to be in Miami and it's going to be such different content for other people. I'm like, I don't give a damn about the content. Like, I'm not going for the content. I'm going because mm-hmm. it was like a goal and like such a big thing for me. Like, I know, like no matter where we go, like no matter what we do in my, our life, like everything is documented and Mm -hmm. I like, it's going to be fun regardless. Right. You know, but, and I know Miami is going to be so much fun. Like the stuff that one day that I have planned, you guys have no idea. I'm so excited. You guys have no idea. I have like a surprise. I I have a surprise plan for the entire family and nobody knows anything. What, what's it related to? Yeah. I'm not saying a damn thing. Not a damn thing. (laughs) <laughs> you give me a painting job i'll do the best damn painting job you've ever you seen the same it's really gonna be the best day of everyone's life i think okay i'm excited or the worst who knows mm. well i'm not gonna say that hell no it's gonna be the best it definitely it's be really exciting so um what were we talking about i don't know abduction fear. is oh, a yeah. fear uh coyotes sharks yeah sharks like, are definitely your ooh, biggest fear. it's a lifelong fear this is like the longevity fear mm. <laughs> My I don't go in the ocean. Yeah, me neither. It. Like knees, and even then, like if we go anywhere further, I have Juan come and I he mm-hmm. like has to hold me. I have a fear of drowning. Ooh, yeah, I understand. That's that. like a I. I also do not go in the water. Like it literally. But took you, you can th- swim. Yes, it took you guys like forty five minutes to try to get me into the ocean at, in Hawaii. Remember, you guys kept saying like, "Come, come, come." Oh, I didn't know that's and why. And I wasn't getting in because I'm afraid of drowning and I'm afraid of sharks. I'm oh. not as afraid as you. you it's, kn- I think it's everyone's fear to be afraid of sharks, but I'm telling you, like, mine's like next level. It's y- my stupid. version of your sharks is snakes. Oh, for real? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. When I was younger, I would every single night I would take my comforter and go like this to make sure there's no snakes under my comforter. Oh, because I, I just have like this mental mental thing that oh. i'm like wait I s- i've seen a snake once in my life and it w- oh like it actually mm-hmm. makes me sick oh my my body's shivering it was in la Where? and it was dead it was like wrapped around it was massive ew we were with like eric and his cousins and their ew friends. that's disgusting Ugh. like i can't no anacondas are what freak me the fuck out any any kind let me tell you if you have a snake in your home as a pet, you are a freak. <laughs> <laughs> and we're You're talking my anaconda don't, my, my anaconda, anaconda don't, don't want none unless you got buns, buns hun. This boy named Troy. Like, you can go on. That song is so good. I got to listen to it today, It's unfortunate actually. she sucks live. Anyways. Yeah. <laughs> I'll throw that jab in the there. last episode to know why. She I, oh, it died. It's fine. We're yeah. going to keep going. 